welcome to chargeback installation. We've unzipped the files and we kick off the install following the steps. Read your license agreement and agree if you want to continue with installation. We've selected the default path for the installation. You can change this. This is connecting to the chargeback database. We installed SQL. You can also install Oracle. Fill in the database name and authentication details. We used a default SQL instance name. If you have a specific name, enter the details here. This is an account that you'll use to log into Chargeback. Note it because you'll need it later. It is not the default username and password. We then install data collectors and during this installation you can also install them later on in Chargeback. We used vCloud Director. Here we enter details for the vCloud Director database name, the port used to connect to it, Make sure you have the syntax exactly correct. For the database URL, you will use the IP address to connect to the database. We test the connection to the database. We test the connection, not successful. make sure it is successful, the Oracle daemon is running, or if installed SQL, that SQL is up and running. We continue with install, so pre-configuration is done, and then we, at the end of the screen we get a URL that's used to connect through Explorer to charge back. We connect to charge back, in this case using start program files, and then you get opportunity to enter your key for charge back. Thank you for watching this video.